what is up and welcome back to my channel so i know i always keep on telling that i'll be uploading videos regularly but i'm very lazy when it comes to editing but i'm gonna try and vlog as much as i can so before i start uploading videos of what i eat in a day i wanted to show you guys how i meal prep because meal prep is something that's really important if you wish to stay on track and i love meal prepping i meal prep about once a week or once in 10 days depending upon how much i get so my kitchen counter is full right now and I'm going to show you one by one what exactly I get and what I love. I'll show you all my carb source, protein and fat source as well. So that once you have a clear picture of what my diet looks like, understanding what I eat in a day videos will become a little more easier. I'm wearing a cap because I just got back from my workout and my hair is really sweaty and messy. So in order to hide the mess, cap works. Starting with my protein sources, I really love chicken in my diet. So I get these packs, this is about 1 kilogram and this is my main source of protein so I will clean this and put them in a little container and then freeze them and take out one container and grill it. My second protein source is Basa fish. I just got half kg of it because I eat it just once a week and I really love including fish, some kind of fish in my diet. I cannot cook fish so I do not have a lot of recipes about fish, my mom helps me cook that. My third protein source is paneer. I like eating vegetarian source of protein once a week and paneer is something that I really enjoy. I like to grill it in a little bit of olive oil and then add it to my salad. My next protein source is quinoa. If you guys know I carb cycle so I really like including quinoa in my diet whenever I am on higher carb days and whenever I want bulk in my meal. So that is when I add quinoa. And my last protein source is tofu. So, I like to make tandoor of them. Banao do ke teri tandoori. Banao? So that was all my protein sources. And also apart from this, I have eggs as well. So I need to go and buy eggs. But these are my protein sources and it is going to last me over a week. And I absolutely love adding good source of protein in my diet. And apart from this, of course, I have whey protein. And that is the only form of protein which I have. And I do not have it every day. It's just when I work out. It's just when I weight train, I have it as my post-workout meal. For my sources of fat, I mostly have some kind of seed oil or mostly I get it from paneer as well if I'm eating paneer. So my favorite is some seed mix. Any seed mix works. Right now I'm using this by 6th Element and it's very tasty. And I like to cook one of my meals in coconut oil. So this is organic coconut oil. This is something I really enjoy. And all my other meals are cooked in olive oil. Now let me show you what are veggies I get whenever I go and meal prep and these are some basic standard veggies that I really enjoy. I love having lettuce in my diet and I go to Reliance Fresh to get lettuce because I do not get it in the local vegetable market. And the other thing that I get from uh, Reliance is zucchini. Now zucchini is kind of luxurious, it's very expensive in India. Um, I have it on and off just because I love the taste, it is not a necessity but um, if I can get it, I definitely get it. And the other veggies which I'm going to show you, I get it from local vegetable market. So my favorite is capsicum, so it's a kg of capsicum and it's going to last me for a really long time. I almost eat like a one or two a day. And that mushroom that's very seasonal, if I get it good, fresh, that is when I get mushroom. Lemon, you guys know I like to start my day with lemon water or I add it to my salad. Tomatoes, ye ghar ke liye bhi hai and I like add it and I like eating at least one tomato a day. Um, now this bag has um, broccoli. Um, broccoli, is, it's very seasonal. If it's very expensive, I do not buy it. But if it's very cheap, I definitely get it. This was like about 40 rupees for half a kg. This was for 40 rupees half kg so I just got it. And then bell peppers. So whenever you cook bell peppers, um, they taste exactly the same. But if you like eating raw, they taste very different. And this is like my necessity when it comes to salads. Next is dill leaf. I like adding it to my salad as a herb. It's very tasty, very fresh. And with cucumber, it's a very good combination. Then next is coriander. This is like one of my absolute favorite herbs. I like adding it. I like making a dressing with it that is just curd and coriander and it's damn tasty. The next thing is cucumber. I love snacking on cucumbers and I love adding it to my salad as well. Um, I do not include a lot of carrots in my diet but I think I need to include 
but I think I need to start adding carrots to my diet. So probably I'm gonna grill some carrot and add cinnamon on top, and it's gonna be very tasty. So I just got a lot of carrots. And then there's spinach. I like to add it to my lettuce base and also to my smoothies. And this is beetroot. I wanted to make beetroot latte and also love adding it to my salad because it just gives so much of color and it's high in vitamins as well. So I love it. So when it comes to fruit, I am a sucker for seasonal fruits. So I always have banana. Now no, eating banana does not make you gain weight. It is all about calories and being into calorie deficit. So you need to control the intake of banana. So I love adding it to my smoothies and strawberries are in season and also are kiwi. So I will be cutting them and putting them into a container and freezing these fruits. So whenever I want to make smoothie, I will just take frozen fruits and add it to my smoothies and blend it. And also pomegranate. These are so damn delicious. So that is it guys. That was a very short video but these are the basic necessity of my meal and I really love them. I can adjust without one or two of these. But apart from that, at least basic like cucumber, capsicum, tomatoes. These are the basic things which I really need in my diet. And these are high in nutrition, high in vitamins. I do not take any kind of vitamin supplements because of that. Yes, eating healthy is very expensive. Of course it is. Everything of this, it costed me about 2000 Like I've spent 2000 in one day and it will last me for about 10 days. I, I spend a little more than I should be. But then... Gradually, I have realized that eating healthy is expensive, but it is so beneficial. It gives you good skin, good hair. I do not spend a lot of money on skincare products or hair care products because my diet is too good. At least I'm proud of it and it, at least it works for me because I know how my body reacts to everything. And so that is the only reason why I like to spend good amount of money in my diet. I like to heal myself internally rather than uh, beauty supplies and everything so i hope this helped you guys a little and from next video onwards it's going to be what i eat in a day video so whenever you want to come and see what kind of groceries i buy you can just come over to this video and see it so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and also i would love if you can give me a suggestion that if you would want my videos to be in hindi or in english Thank you. <laughs> Bye.